Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys. And as you can see, we are on our Let's Clash account, guys. Um, I made a base design for y'all the other day on Clash of Clans Builder. Um, some of you liked it, some of you didn't. <laughs> um, and then I made this other one, um, kind of specifically for me, because I'm not in a clan right now. This is, I made this one, it's called The Sub Zone. Um, you guys can join if you want to, but eventually we're going to kick everyone out. Um, and then this is the channel, or this is the clan that me and BJ are going to do um, our little, I don't know, talk to you guys thing. <laughs> Who knows what it's going to be. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and review the base for you guys a little bit, and then we will have an attack at the end. I'm also going to, why don't we do an attack at the beginning and see what we can find. Um... But this is army comp I'm running with. I've been doing giant healer. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I did two giant or twelve giants, um, two healers, and um, about six wall breakers. Just because I really like wall breakers, I like being able to get into the base. Um, and then we bring out archers and goblins, of course, as well as some barbarians. Um, we're just gonna train these guys up, and then we will come back. So let's go ahead and find an attack. I don't care. I'm gonna break my shield. Um, and I will be back with you guys in a couple of seconds once I find a base that is worthy of attacking. All right, so I'll see you guys in a few. All right, guys, look at this. This is some awesome freaking loot. Um, the guy only has one uh, one air defense, which is perfect for me. I'm going to go ahead and lay down some barbarians, and then let's get these uh, giants in here. Um, wait for that mortar shell to hit, drop down some wall breakers, get us in there. And then once the giants knock that down, we can go ahead and drop our two healers right there. And now we pretty much just wait. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and drop a wall breaker right there um, to help get that corner out. My wall breakers are pretty weak. Um, it's weird It's weird comparing my troops at Town Hall 8 to, um, to Town Hall 7 with them not really upgraded. Just because it's so, so very different um, when it comes to how much damage they do and um, all that kind of stuff. But as you can see, a lot of the loot in this base is in the uh, mines and collectors. So I am going to um, slowly deploy around the base to get some of that stuff. Um, the, his defenses are, are pretty good. Um, a lot of my giants are going down, but it's okay. I think we'll still be able to... Um, I think we'll still be able to get a pretty good majority of this base. I'm pretty tired right now, so I'm sorry if I sound like I'm tired. I am. <laughs> and I'm still a little bit sick. Right, I'm going to deploy the rest of my troops on this back end right here. Um, since the majority of those defenses are gone. Um, and then my giants are going to work their way around. Hopefully we can take out the town hall as well as um, the mines and collectors that are in here. Looks like we're actually going to be able to... Um, get pretty close to a three star. I think we'll have enough time um, as long as those cannons keep focusing on the giants and we should be fine. And these archers are about to get into the wall right there at the bottom. There we go. They can now take out that cannon. And then the only defense that's going to be left is the one up top. <laughs> now finally the giants break through. And then it looks like we should be able to get the rest of the loot. Um, one of our healers is still up. I guess one of them. Oh, no, both of them are. <laughs> they were just right on top of each other. Um, looks like that's going to be it, guys. This is actually an awesome raid. Um, I wasn't expecting to find that so quick. Um, it was like three bases after I said goodbye to you guys. So there we go, guys. Perfect 100%. Awesome freaking amount of loot. That's what I'm talking about. Yay, yay. Let's go ahead and get back in here. Um, I believe we have two builders up. Yep, two builders up that we can upgrade with. Um, I always leave one available so that I can upgrade walls because clearly I need to upgrade my walls. <laughs> um, I'm going to get all of them up to level 6 before I start upgrading the other ones. Um, but why don't we go ahead and talk about this base a little bit. So since I am in a clan that isn't that active, um, I have my clan castle off to the side. Um, so... That's why that's there. I know normally I always say have your clan castle in the middle, but since I don't use it that much, um, I am not going to be putting it in the middle. Um, 
Then I have a mortar centralized, obviously. As you can see, it covers the majority of the base. And then I have my other mortars like this, so that my entire base is covered by mortars. And the mortars are very well protected as well within um, at least two layers of walls. Um, next we have our air defenses, as you can see. And I'm actually going to upgrade this top one right here. There we go. Um, wow, I have a long way to go on that. <laughs> um, so the air defenses are protected by two layers of walls as well um, so that they can help protect against mass dragon so on and so forth um, being within the walls helps that out a lot um, I'm not protecting my dark elixir right now um, especially since I don't have a drill I'm not really raiding for it too much um, I'll get it as I get it I believe that the barbarian king is what 10,000 oh, he needs to be an army um, yeah, so he's 10,000, so I'm not going to be there for a long time. I'm not really trying to get him yet. Um, I want to get everything up and running <laughs> and to a good level before um, I start raiding, particularly for Dark Elixir. Um, I might look through some of my defenses and find bases that have already attacked me and then just be a jerk and lightning spell the Dark Elixir. Um, I guess that isn't really being a jerk. It's part of the game. <laughs> um... But yeah, so we have the wizards as well who are protecting our resources. Um, and then we have our Teslas with our traps right here, uh, which I love doing. I love using traps. And then we also have a trap right here as well as a trap right there. We have our air bombs out there. And then we have everything else pretty much um, spread out around the base. I want to upgrade my walls, but I also want to get my defenses up. I might. How long is this going to take? 12 hours? I'm just doing it. I don't need to upgrade walls for 12 hours. Um, so, yeah, there's that. Let's see. I guess there isn't really too much else to talk about. I have my mines um, inside the corners as well, um, so that as they deploy archers on the corner and whatnot. Oops. Low battery. No. Um yeah but that's pretty much it guys let me know what y'all think about the base design I like it um, have I even been attacked on it yet I guess I have since I broke a shield earlier um, I probably got wrecked so the first one isn't bad let's go let's look at this one real quick somebody else attacked me with giant healer we can go down and take a look at that I'm not sure if it's on this base or on the other one yet so here's this one let's go ahead and fast forward through it so that guy is just coming after the town hall um, he didn't even need to deploy that many troops. <laughs> That's funny. So he's just trying to lazy farm me right now. Um, he's not doing a legitimate attack. Um, yeah, so he's just going after my mines and my pumps. Uh, so yeah, you know, why don't we go ahead and go back on that one? That wasn't interesting at all. <laughs> um, and let's see. Let's look at this one. Oh no, I got three starred. Yay. And you're going to get three-starred a lot um, whenever you go to a new town hall and you haven't upgraded stuff. But this is on my old base. Obviously, I'm going to get three-starred with how it was laid out. So we don't even need to watch that. Um, but it looks like so far we're doing good on this new base. Only two attacks. Um, none of them have been really serious attacks at all. But I like this base. I've never used this one before. I'm going to learn about it. You guys can take a little screenshot right there if you want to. Um, and try it out for yourselves. It does really good at protecting my resources, obviously, except for my Dark Elixir, but um, if I wanted to, I can always take one of these guys out and just put my Dark Elixir uh, right there. So I'm not going to do that yet because I am still trying to upgrade my defenses and stuff. So once I do start farming for Dark Elixir, I'm going to move that in. Um, but for the most part, that is it, guys. Y'all can join the clan if you want to, like I said. Um, I'm not on this as much as my other one my town hall 8 because I am almost town hall 9 and I need to get it up there um, but yeah guys that's gonna be it for this episode I hope that y'all enjoyed leave a like or a comment and if you're new to the channel guys go ahead and subscribe you can ask everyone else I post frequently and um, I have fun doing it so thank you so much for watching guys y'all rock I really do mean that and as always guys make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me alright I'll see you guys later